Good morning everyone and welcome to Vlogmas day three. Hope you guys are all well this morning. I didn't actually end up going to bed until like 2am last night. I had to do my meds, took me a while. And after I did my like non-oral med, you know, I was talking about it last night, you guys know which one. I was getting really severe stomach cramps, but like not in my tummy, like in my bowel colon area. It was really painful. So it kept me awake for a little bit and I just, oh my God, felt awful. So I was gonna get up at 8 a.m again just so that i could get my video edited for today and whatnot but i ended up sleeping until 10 just had my breakfast and it was nice the only thing is we have these like poached egg cookers and they're not actually very good they don't always cook the egg properly so like you'll think your egg's cooked and then it's like a bit goopy do you know what i mean did i eat it anyway i did Am I concerned I'm gonna get sick now? I am. I'm not really sure what we're gonna be doing today. And I'm back at work tomorrow, so I have a couple of things I have to do. So like I need to iron my uniform, do a bit of cooking. I wanna put up the Christmas tree today as well, but I'm not sure whether we're gonna do that. But I just thought, again, I'd bring you guys along with me, see what we're gonna do today. I feel like I might be getting sick. Like, I feel like I might be getting mats, cold or flu or virus or whatever it is. I've just been finishing off yesterday's vlog on the couch and I'm falling asleep. And I've noticed I look really tired. Like, I was editing the footage and my bags just look massive under my eyes. And I feel exhausted. My chest feels a bit heavy as well, so I don't know whether I'm getting what Matt's got. I just don't feel... 100% so I actually bought ingredients to make soup and I feel like when you're ill I do anyway I crave soup so I've got a red pepper soup so I'm gonna just start making that now because then I can always have some for lunch and I'll show you guys how I do it what I use I've also got my ninja soup maker as well which is really handy whenever I make soup I go to Tesco and I get this bread. I'm going to show you guys it now because it's delicious. So this is the salt and pepper baguette honestly it is absolutely gorgeous but it tastes so good the red pepper soup is actually a gusto recipe i actually washed this yesterday and stuff on it already wts is ganon right so i'm doubling up because i wanted to make more just so i've got it like in the freezer one red onion i don't like onion so i only will usually put half an onion in so for the recipe if you wanted to make it for four you'd actually put two red onions in but i just don't like onion so i'm gonna put a whole onion in because usually i just put half in so one whole onion four red peppers two tins of finely chopped tomatoes balsamic vinegar two cloves of garlic and some nor vegetable stock cubes So I've just added salt, pepper and some olive oil to all of that veg all chopped up. Give it a mix round and put it in the oven for 20 to 25 minutes. I'm just going to leave them to cook. You want them to like char slightly. So I feel like I might put too much olive oil on. But as you guys can see some of it is char in here. So I'm going to take it out and put it in for like an extra 5 minutes. But I feel like it looks okay. I wish you guys could smell it because it smells honestly delicious. So I'm going to quickly move on to the next part. Oh god, why is my somewhat wonky? the fuck is your son meant to look like that is that normal what the actual heck why does that look weird oh god my thumb has just given me the ick i popped it in this pot for a little while mixed the veg and like the liquid stock and all that sort of thing together added two teaspoons of sugar two 
two and a half tablespoons of balsamic vinegar and then I popped it in the ninja soup maker on the smooth soup setting that's like half an hour long it like heats up and stuff so it's all ready to go so I'm gonna open my advent calendar he did his too last night he's just absolutely butchered his I didn't even open that one properly. I'm gonna do that for a bit again. So we've got a little North Pole, a snowman, and then we have a little snowman chocolate as well. So I'm gonna enjoy this. Before Christmas tree, tree after. And then we've got little. Oh my god. <laughs> Yucca plant. <clears throat> Excellent growth, right? Two succulents on the side. Excellent growth, right? <laughs> Fucking hell. <clears throat> Matt is very proud mm. of all of his plants. I want a fake tree. <laughs> all right, there we go. Right, we've got the tree, the Christmas tree. So pretty. Then <clears throat> we've got these little, what would you call them, Matt? Little buildings, little buildings. Ornaments. Ornaments, and then we have this little one here, which actually had tea bags in it, but it lights up. I think it was from m and wasn't it? What's your favorite bauble on the tree? I like the sloth, and then Father Christmas as well. I feel like this is a fun-filled Christmassy design <laughs> with gold and red classics. Beautiful. Where's the cars? I really like the cars. Oh, we've got like ice creams and donuts, little gingerbread. We've got these little cars as well. I'm really happy with it. I think it looks really nice. Very happy with the Christmas tree and these little Christmas trees. And we've got the ribbon as well. And our little candy canes. We need to get something for the top of the tree. But we just haven't been able to find anything that kind of goes with the tree. Then we've got our initials up here as well before. I forget to show you guys. So cute. I'm really happy with it. I think it looks lovely. And then these buildings. I don't know. Churches, whatever. And they light up as well. They're so cute. And then this one. I'll show you close up with this one as well. Like that. Very nice. <laughs> Hello, it's a lot later on now, it's about 20 past 11. I'm in work tomorrow, so I'm trying to be organized and go to bed at a reasonable time. After we put up the Christmas tree, we nip to Tesco to go and get Matt some ibuprofen, some Vicks Vapor Rub, and also his tea, because I was just having a pizza. We came home, we ate tea, and then I just started editing this vlog so all the footage that i've got already i just started editing it so that in the morning i don't have too much to do as i said before i'm in work tomorrow so i just wanted to make sure that i had as much done as possible before i have to get up tomorrow and stop panicking that i've not done do you know like what i need to have done if that makes sense so i've edited the footage i've got so far i did the music and stuff there's only a couple of bits and pieces that i have left to do i don't know what the vlog's gonna be like tomorrow i'm on a half ten half seven so i'm gonna see how much footage i can grab tomorrow as i said i'm just gonna keep going with these vlogs to braided my hair so it doesn't get knotty because i keep making up the giant knots in my hair guys also if you see me not drinking a lot of water in my videos can you shout at me please because today i've drunk 700 mils of water and that's it 700 mils of water in one day and i wonder why i don't feel well and why i feel like i'm getting ill so guys i'm just gonna go brush my teeth take my meds and go to sleep as i am gonna get up quite early in the morning to finish off today's video so i hope you guys enjoyed it if you did make sure you give it a thumbs up and subscribe if you haven't already i hope you guys have all had a lovely day and i will see you all tomorrow for another vlog bye guys